So we're in northern Uganda in a district called Kochgoma, which is about 25 kilometers away from the main town. It's all mud huts, very agricultural, exceptionally poor. We work in the local primary school up the road, which has about 1,200 children, very few resources, often only have one meal a day, which is in the evening. And we're trying to find out where the children are with disabilities because they're not in school. And so we've come into the local villages and we've just interviewed Emma, who is seven years old, and the father says that you can't walk properly, but clearly there's other issues going on. Seems to be some kind of learning disability, couldn't swallow, mouth to one side, but there's nowhere locally that can diagnose that issue or problem. And also what's coming across is a sense of shame if your child has a disability, particularly certain types like mental illness. And so what we're trying to do is go back to them, find them in the villages and give them a voice, help them tell their story and based on that, we're going to try and find a project to help them and give them the support that they need. And you're just left feeling very sad for the parent. Emma is still young, he's seven years old. There's still a chance that he can have a good education and make a full life for himself. But at the moment, he's excluded and the prospects aren't good. You're just stuck in a mud hut with nothing else to do.